whether it's vegan restaurants, um, vegan products, they end up tasting really good because I mean they get really into the seasoning and making it taste up to par. And Lenny Larry's definitely tastes better than this, to be honest. <laughs> What's up, Diabander Nation? We are back with another food test review. And up again, we have Quest Nutrition. Here I have the Quest Cookie and also Quest Peanut Butter Cups. I'm actually pretty excited to try these peanut butter cups. I haven't had peanut butter cups in years, like since I was a kid. But I'm first gonna start with the cookie because I, what I wanna do is compare this to Len and Larry's Complete Cookie. So taking a look at the back of the nutrition label here, for one whole cookie, it's 250 calories, 17 grams of fat, 19 grams of carbs, 15 grams of protein. So slightly higher than the Len and Larry cookie that I tried in the previous episode, but the usual cookie that's sold by Len and Larry's is the complete, like the full cookie. So it's gonna be double what it actually says on the label. So about 400 calories. So I think, I believe New Quest Nutrition only sells this size. So it actually is gonna be less than what you typically buy from Len and Larry's. It says soft and chewy on the front, so I'm gonna see how true that is. Um, I mean, definitely feels soft. The Len and Larry's wasn't that chewy until you warmed it up, so that's something to take note of if you want a chewier cookie. Maybe Quest might be the one for you. Otherwise, if you want something that's a bit more on the firm side, Len and Larry's is good. Now I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna eat it without warming it up first, but then of course I have to warm it up because there's a difference. So it had an interesting smell immediately as I opened it up. I don't really know how to describe it. I think it's the chocolate. I don't know what differently they do with their chocolate, but um, with Len and Larry's, they don't have any dairy, egg, soy. This does contain egg, soy, wheat, peanuts, or no, sorry, it's processed in a facility that also processes egg, soy, wheat, peanuts, and tree nuts, contains milk. So there's dairy in this. Um, yeah, but I'm gonna try it and see what it tastes like first. Based on how it looks, the cookie, you know, it's really light, as you can see. Um, kind of crumbly. Okay, this is not bad. I'm not crazy about it. As far as the taste goes, whatever they do to make the cookie is just not, it's not that tasty. Um, I do prefer Lenin Larry's. We're talking about flavor. Um, which is interesting because that's a completely vegan cookie and they often say like whether it's vegan restaurants um, vegan products they end up tasting really good because I mean they get really into the seasoning and making it taste up to par and Lenny Larry's definitely tastes better than this to be honest <laughs> yeah I'm not crazy about it it's the cookie itself I mean the chips the chips are very light in flavor um, they're not very sweet, but whatever, whatever the recipe is, however they make the cookie, it's okay. Like I wouldn't, I'd prefer the Lennon Larry's over this. Maybe they have other flavors that taste better than the chocolate chip. This is the only one I picked up, but as far as the chocolate chip goes, I don't know. It's okay. I'll give us like a six. Now for the fun one, and I hope this one doesn't disappoint because I'm actually looking forward to it. I've never tried these. A protein peanut butter cup. Seems pretty cool. But yeah, let's see how this tastes. Okay, cool. Not too big in size, but they definitely do look like Reese's peanut butter cups. Um, so for two of these, not just one, it's 190 calories, 15 grams of fat, 13 grams of carbs and 11 grams of protein. So always make sure to look at the back of the nutrition label because sometimes it might just be for one. But but in this case, it's two. So let's get into it. These are really good. If you love Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, if you're a Reese's Peanut Butter Cups person, you're going to like these. You say it's fantastic. The balance could be a bit better. There's definitely a lot more chocolate than the peanut butter, but um, it's it's good. I cannot complain. It's smooth. There's no weird 
aftertaste or anything like that. It's a really solid, solid protein Reese's peanut butter cup or solid Quest Nutrition peanut butter cup. So really good if you want to have a sweet treat every now and then, if you want to just satisfy some cravings for chocolate, if you're a chocolate person, definitely get these. 190 calories, so not too bad, and but they're going to be a lot more nutritionally better for you than having a Reese's peanut butter cup. Definitely get these. I would give these a solid 8.5, 8.3 around there but that's it for the review though the cookie was not a fan of the taste um yes it was chewy and I, I didn't really really need to heat it up because after i tasted it, i was like eh. i mean maybe i should have heated it up i don't know i just i wasn't really a fan of the taste i don't think that would have helped it you know so maybe go with the lenny larry's lenny larry's um it was okay so yeah i gave this one a six 8.3 8.5 these are delicious but that's it for the review. I'm definitely gonna continue trying some more Quest Nutrition products, but I'm also gonna mix it up, try to find some more unknown brands that have healthier or protein versions of some of your favorite snacks and foods.